When you're working with notebooks in VS Code, you'll see a global toolbar at the top of the file that lets you perform actions in that current notebook. So you can see here, I can do things like adding a new code cell, for example. So I could do like print one. You can see I added that new Python cell very easily. I can go and add new markdown cells. I can even go and run the uh, different Python cells I have here, or I can go and clear all the outputs. Now, if you want to, you can actually easily disable this global toolbar so that these actions are going to be visible instead in the editor tabs, or you can perform them using keyboard shortcuts or the command palette instead. So to do that, I'm going to open up my settings with control comma or command comma on Mac and search for global toolbar. And I want the notebook global toolbar setting here. Again, the default is to have this enabled, but if I go and I turn this off and switch back to the notebook file, you can see that the global toolbar at the top of the file is no longer there. And instead these commands are being displayed in the tab list here over to the side. So I can perform all of the same actions. Um, in this case, it is just displaying them uh, in a different location here. Now there's one other setting related to the global toolbar here. So if I go switch back here and look at the notebook global toolbar show label command here, I'm gonna actually turn the global toolbar back on. And you can see it has all these labels for the different commands here. If I actually go back to this notebook global toolbar show label uh, setting here and turn that off, you can see that the toolbar is now a lot more compact. So it's actually compressed everything down and it is no longer showing the labels for each of these. So if I actually wanted to run all, I can still do that just by clicking on the run all uh, icon here, but it no longer has that label for run all. So that's a quick look at the global toolbar in VS Code's notebooks and a few of the settings you can use to configure it.